man, R2, man, I don't know why they even tripping on me, man. I'm just trying to do, man, what's that, man? Is he, is he doing, come on, man, Bebop, man. Come on, man, you know what you're supposed to be doing, man. man do your stuff, Bebop, man. R2, everybody tripping, man. Just, just cue the, cue the video, man. Cue the intro. Cue the intro. You are now entering the realm of the canine OG. This channel is intended for a mature audience with an open mind and understanding and respect for the thoughts and ideas of others. Parental discretion is advised. Please like, subscribe, and share. And don't forget to visit our many playlists. They've been researched and organized with hundreds of fabulous videos for your learning and viewing pleasure. Enjoy. Wow, man, this particular caiman is very mean. She's not at all like my girl, Sophie. What's up, YouTube, man? I'm gonna show y'all a little bit on how I feed my soft animals right now. I got two little kind of dishes that I make. They're not even dishes, really. It's just, um, I got the, the stuff that I put together. I will do a chinchilla thing and I'll do a rabbit thing. I'm not gonna do all the individual ones because I'm not showing you like you know me feeding the group or whatever. I'm just gonna show you me making the food for the animals and what it consists of. I'll have a pellet for the chinchilla. I have a pellet for the rabbit. I have some wild seed bird seeds that I add for extra little stuff that they pick up off the ground and stuff. I have some uh, Timothy hay. And I have others, various greens and fruits and stuff that I uh, cut up and put up in here too. Uh, I'll tell you what I'm doing today and I'll show you what's going on with uh, my chinchillas and my rabbits. All right, here we go. We got everything kind of separated out a little bit, man. If you notice, this is how I feed. I normally kind of do this twice a day. And this is the thing that I do. I'm going to have some hay. I'm going to have various greens in the wall. I'm still going to use a pellet. I do that anyway. But then I give them various cuts up right here. Like I have apples. I have carrots. I have celery. I have only uh, one piece of cut banana. You got to be careful with your chinchillas. Like he only gets one banana, you know what I'm saying? And he doesn't get that all the time, but I have to cut it up because it's too much sugar for a chinchilla. Be careful with your chinchilla sugar. If you're giving them apples and anything like that, I give apples and bananas because I like, I go by nutrition. You know, they need certain things like potassium and certain things and all of your, all of your rollers are gonna need a lot of hay. You're gonna need a lot of hay, a lot, a lot of hay to chew on, right? So now this is my rabbit, this is for one rabbit, right? You know, and that's like all various little seeds and all kind of little things in there for them and everything. I'm not promoting any products, anything like that, but if somebody got a product they want me to promote, I'll put it out there. But this is how I feed my rabbits and my chinchillas right now, man. I like to natural feed, but I still put a pellet. Cause see, it's a pellet in here with this too, if you notice. There's pellets in here with this rabbit stuff and a little, little couple of little vitamin tablets and stuff. I try to cover all the bases. That's what I'm doing. When I do this, I'm trying to cover everything that they would need in their natural habitats because before I get an animal, I normally study for about two months or so, something like that. I study the habitat, I study the environment and different things like that. And then I, I study the, uh, the well, all levels of the environment. And then I try to recreate that. I try to recreate their environment with as much nutrition and as much uh, stimulation, positive stimulation as I can on my animals. And so this is chinchilla, this is the chinchilla plate here. This is chinchilla food, that's chinchilla. And this is rabbits, this is rabbits. Various greens, I'm not gonna tell you what to feed, I'm just gonna give you a good idea of what I'm doing. Fruits and vegetables, baby. Oh, Y'all gotta excuse my music in the background. I, somebody just brought to my attention what I'm playing in the background. But I, I gotta play music while I'm doing my work, man. And this is my lion head, right? This is a lion head I like. 
my little female along here. And look at the hair on these things, man. You would never know how small she really is if you look at her like this. But look at this hair, man. Look at her. This is my lion head female. Look at her. Wow, man. These are some fabulous animals, man. I'm really into the luxurious animals, man. They just so nice, man. They act different too. It's a difference to have these animals, man. I can sit there and pet this animal, man. And it'll you know, just calm you down, man. You just gotta calm down when you're with these animals, man. You can't be upset, man. You can't be aggressive. You can't even be angry when you have a lion head like this, man. Look at her, man. Oh, man. Wow. All right, YouTube. Look at my lion head. This is my girl, though. I like her, man. It's the K9 OG. Who you with? Who you with? It's the K9 OG, baby.